Well, I'm having a day out today. We're visiting one or two pigeon lofts. And this is Les Kid of New Milton. This is Les's very smart loft. It's 16 foot long. And he's an avid long distance racer. A real long distance enthusiast. Morning Les. Morning Keith. I haven't seen you for a few years boy. No, not since you last convoying at Tarbs. Yeah. But how long have you been living in Hampshire now? Because you used to live in... Um, Sunbury. Sunbury, yeah. Yeah, 14 years, Keith. Yeah, you love it down here? Oh, absolutely marvellous. You're looking well, mate. Yeah, the old weather's good down here. Yeah. So, tell us a little bit about your pigeons. Do you, you race a long distance? Yeah, distance only. And they're, they're the old English family. They go back to Ian Benstead. And they go back to 1905, the A.E. Shepherd strain of yeah. North London. Yeah. A very inbred family. Yeah, he had some good pigeons, didn't he? Oh, Ian Benson, he, he, yeah. had, he had some crackers. and Won the combine a couple of times, didn't he? Well, I'll tell you, I'll tell you when it all changed. Is I think it was in 1977, yeah. me and Johnny Wills, we went to an Ian Benson auction. He only had about 12 pigeons for sale. I bought a hen and Johnny Wills bought a cock. Yeah. And from then on, me and John cultivated the family. Never look back. Never Johnny, back. Johnny's had some fantastic performance as well. On a hard day, these Bensteads, the old shepherd pigeons, yeah. they're, they're absolutely marvellous. Yeah. So what's your favourite race point? Where do you, where do you like racing well, from? Tarbes really. 500 miles on a day, that's my ambition. Yeah, that's brilliant. Oh, that's the ultimate, I think. Yeah. What's your best position you won in down here? Um, fifth open Tarbes and ninth open Tarbes. Yeah. Fifth open Barcelona, eighth open Barcelona. Um, I've won two Merit Awards. Yeah. Um, all from distance racing. Brilliant mate, absolutely fantastic. So what system you race your old birds on? All natural, all yeah, natural yeah. racing. And uh, do mostly better with ends than I do cops. Yeah. Uh, also I was 25th open Marseille this year, won yeah, the section. Yeah. Fantastic mate. Yeah. Let's have a look at the birds in. This is a beautiful end, what's this one? This is a Merit Award winner, won the blue ribbon for three times out of tarps. Yeah. In the result. Can you remember her positions? Uh, not offhand, no. um, but if I if I show the other merit of all, I can remember her positions. Yeah, but she's well three done. times in the first hundred. Brilliant. Was that in the Central Southern Classic? In the Central Southern Classic. Yeah. How far did you throw from Tarbes? Five hundred and twenty-six. Yeah, it's brilliant. Brilliant, mate. She's beautiful. And was she a, a shepherd pigeon as well? Yeah, she's a direct daughter of um, favourite sister, yeah. who was also twenty-first open San Sebastian yeah. in the North East Wind. What's her best nest condition? Sitting 10. I'll try and get them all sitting 10, 14 days. Yeah, she's a beautiful one, mate. Absolute crack, isn't she? Yeah, she's lovely. Lovely, and she's very kind and all. This is Leslie's old bird section. He has 20 pairs on the natural, and he's very successful at a long distance. Another nice end, Les. What's this one? This is another Merit Award winner. Um, she was 50th open tarps, 46 open tarps, and 26 open tarps. Yeah, fantastic. This, this year. Was she another Benstead pigeon? Yeah, another another one out of the family, yeah. So tell me a little bit about the family. Well, I've had this family 35 years now, and I only bring in an English cross, such as Norman Southwell through Jimmy Shepherd. I brought the Titmus pigeons in through Kenny Irons and the Mike Young pigeons through the Spangles. Yeah. All English strain of pigeons. All fantastic families of pigeons, mate. Yeah. So they've knitted well for you, mate. Yeah. Well done, Les. This is Les's wonderful garden in New Milton. And all the garden is done by his wife, Cynthia. This is my second loft visit today. This is a second member of the London Mafia. This is Rod Berry and his wife Angela at New Milton. Morning Rod. Morning Keith. How long have you been down in Hampshire now? Uh, seven years. Yeah, I wish you like it. Yeah, lovely. Hey, it's a fantastic place, yeah, isn't it? Yeah. What's it like for pigeon racing? Uh, difficult. Is it? Yeah, because uh, living on the coast, they go past and then you've lost it. You know? Yeah, yeah. 
So, so what sort of racing are you doing down here? Well, every race I'm getting. What's that, Fed and not Classic? Fed, Classic, so I yeah, belong yeah. to all the Classics, Nationals. Yeah. What's one or two of your best positions? Uh, best positions, uh, uh, first, second and third in the uh, Solent Fed, two and a half thousand pigeons yeah. from Carrington. Yeah. I've had six first sections, uh, five first sections in the Classics and Nationals. Yeah. And uh, three weeks ago, uh, first fed from 2,300 pigeons. Yeah, that's a great club at Central, at uh, uh, yeah, Central Southern Yeah, Classic. Run, run by good people. Brilliant secretary, yeah. mate. Yeah. Uh, clear, let's get out on the video. Yeah. No, yeah. it's a great club, mate, great club. They're going for years, at. So what system are you racing down here? Uh, well, I've raced the Widowed system since uh, 1969. Yeah with great success, but since I've been only got a small loft, I've been raising the hens. Yeah. But, uh, it's like a roundabout system. A roundabout, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. How many pairs you got? Uh, 15 pair. Yeah. When did you pair them up? Uh, last week in January. Yeah, yeah. So what pigeons do you race down here now? Uh, uh, basically yeah. the uh, Jan scenes, because uh, I like every race and they yeah. seem to do it. You haven't got any old Catrice left? No, afraid not. They were brilliant pigeons up, brilliant. up in the middle sex, weren't they? They certainly was. And they're North Road pigeons, they? Well, well, You're an old boy now, Rod, do you remember? <laughs> <laughs> well, they won everything on the North Fantastic Road. Fantastic pigeons, And yeah. Uh, yeah. everything on the South Road. Yeah, so. Old Eric Adam, didn't he? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so that's great. Mate, so how about your babies? How many babies you keep? Uh, well, 21 on the darkness. Yeah. And uh, uh, I had six races in the club and only lost one. That's brilliant race, yeah, isn't it? Yeah. Brilliant. So what was that sort of west? You go west, do you? Uh, west, yeah. yeah. Yeah, it's absolutely brilliant, mate. Yeah. This is Rod's very smart L-shaped loft. In the first section in the corner, you've got the young birds. And he keeps the widowed ends behind your aviary. Then there's two widowed sections. And a lovely aviary for the widowed cops to get out and have a bath. Nice check of cop. Rod, what's this one? This is my favourite, called Scar. Yeah. He's a, a Jan scene and uh, he's scored 13 times across the channel and he's won nearly three thousand pounds. Yeah, good good widow of cock. Good widow of cock is uh, his father uh, was third combine Bergerac, four hundred and forty, only pigeon on the day from tours, and he won Exeter and he won Nance twice. Yeah, you know, good good breeding. Lovely cock. It's typical gents with that pearly eye and that yeah. slate, yeah. That's right, yeah. Nice pigeon, mate. Let's talk about the old days then. Rod, when did you start up in pigeons? Uh, 1968. Yeah, uh, what was that, in, in Ashford? Ashford, yes. Yeah, and how did you come into racing? Uh, well, my wife's uh, father, Eric Matthews, uh, we moved into his bungalow and he left the loft there. And being as uh, just finished playing football, I, I, uh, pigeons kept coming back and, yeah. you know, that's you how got caught the bug? Yeah. So you flew the North Road edition, didn't uh, you? North Road for 17 years. Yeah. Tell us about one or two best positions. Uh, best positions, uh, well I had a, a famous pigeon called the Bullet, he won 13 first. Uh, I was, uh, you know, uh, first fed, second combine Thurzo when there was only four on the day. Yeah. Uh, I could go on, on and yeah, on. Some fantastic know. positions in those, the old countries. Well, the, yeah, the last race I had Thurzo, uh, I sent 12 Widowed Cox, took the first five in the club, and uh, uh, I had more pigeons home than any club in the Fed or Combine. Yeah, fantastic, mate. Yeah. Fantastic. Have a nice pigeon. Rob, what's this one? Uh, this is a full brother to Scar. His name is Mercedes, and uh, he won as a young bird, and he's, he scored in all the classics, in the nationals, and... Uh, uh, there's not much I can say, and he's bred a fed winner. Yeah, it's fabulous looking cock, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, he's lovely. Better looking than his brother, actually. But he's yeah, he's the, he's the uh, ideal racing pigeon. Yeah. Super cock, mate. A credit to you, mate. Look well and all. Yeah, the it's, well, not, it's not the best time of year to be filming, No, is it? but they spend all the day in the aviary just yeah. letting at night. Brilliant. A few pigeon visits for the day. Yeah. I've got to get back to the caravan now and see the kids. <laughs>